But with all the fear and the uncertainty, both of COVID and its economic impact, many people who were thinking of having a baby are now putting those plans on hold, and those who don't want to get pregnant are taking extra cautions. So Nurex, which is the largest digital practice for women's health, saw a 50% increase in requests for birth control prescriptions when the pandemic hit in March, and also a 40% increase in demand for the morning after pill. Everything from financial security or insecurity, truthfully, yeah. um, as well as, you know, fears around having to go into the hospital and giving birth during this time. So, you know, it's, it's a whole host of reasons that we believe are underlying this increase in demand for contraception. Now, there are lots of studies that prove a direct link between an economic downturn and birth rates going all the way back to the Great Recession. A decade ago, states where the recession was the most severe experienced largest drops in births. Now, researchers at the Brookings Institution have forecast there could be a half million fewer babies born in America this year. Interesting.